Now, in South Georgia, we fortunately escaped really serious damage today, but that was, that was seen in a lot of other areas in the south. But several homes in Calhoun County were damaged. WLB News 10's Ashanti Isaac is in one of those neighborhoods near Arlington. And Ashanti, what did you see today? That's right, Jim and Carla. We're here live in Calhoun County, and this is just a little bit of some of that work that's happening here um, with restoration starting to happen. Now, according to the sheriff's office, there have been a lot of structural damage here in the area. Now, we're on location of one house that has seen some of that structural damage. If you take a look in the back, you can actually see part of a tin roof that flew off of that building and is now laying in this residential yard. And thankfully, the owners of the property, they were not here at the time when this storm has passed through so we're actually just gonna wait on them to actually talk to them hopefully they come home soon so we can actually get some insight about it but on the on the plus side thankfully like I said no one was here but if you take a look you can actually see an oak tree so that kind of shows the powerness or the powerfulness of that wind that came through here this oak tree got knocked over and it's just laying here inside of the yard and if you can hear behind me you can actually hear some of um, some power crews starting to restore power to the area now across Calhoun County according to the sheriff's office the northeast part of the county has received a lot of power damage and some down power Power lines, some poles that are going down in this area. Excuse me now. You can see power crews starting to restore power. They're actually on an irrigation field. There's a lot of irrigation that's happening inside of the county from some of that damage too. But the power crews have been out here working tirelessly all day. And this is just one of the locations where they're trying to get some of that power restored here in Calhoun County. And if you take a look right over here, you can actually see them trying to pull down some of those trees just to try to get some of that debris out of the area. Now from here we are going to go with the sheriff's office to another area that received some of the damage in Calhoun County on Gilliamville Road. Jim and Carla, back to you.